What's up guys, so it's me, John, back again. And remember that one girl, Zoe Laverne, that I talked about? She's the one that, that started crying over her trial with plus her followers. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll put my video up on screen. I'll, like, flash the thumbnail, or, like, what she looks like right now, her. So, apparently she's a pedo. So, yeah, let's, let's talk about that right now. So, Zoe Laverne, this, the, she was a crybaby, and now she's a pedo. So pretty much what happened was, uh, to this 13 year old dude, I, I forgot whatever his name was, I don't care what his name is, uh, so she was like on, she like, she got caught, someone took a picture of her taking a picture, like kissing this dude, like kissing this kid, and apparently he was 13, so that's kind of a, like, catch kind of a big yikes, and apparently her response is even dumber. So let's take a let's take a let's take a quick peek at that, my fellow friend. Oh, and by the way, I'm using Sony Vegas now. That doesn't make a real difference to the video, but I just wanted to I just wanted to mention that I have it now. So if you see the cool epic transitions, that's because I'm using Sony Vegas or like better editing quality. Because I used to use Lightworks, which was great in its own right, but you know I had to up the ante. I didn't pay two hundred dollars for it. Just to let you know, take that what you will. Under the age, and it wasn't a good. Oh, no, dirt dur, it wasn't a good idea. Who thinks it's a good idea? Let me, let me, who thinks about this? Hmm, I'm almost, I'm a grown adult. I'm almost 20. 20, I don't know what she's, I just know she's in like her 20s now. Hmm, I'm almost 20. And I see these 13 year old kids sitting over here. You know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna kiss them. Uh, even though I'm an internet personality, who thinks about that? Like, look, that's such a weird thing to take, think about. Like, you know, I know, we all know you're an idiot. Cause, cause you're, cause you, cause you're, uh, first off, you kiss a 13 year old and you're crying over followers. Uh, so, and second of all, who just, who just flat out thinks it's a good idea to think a 13? Moose just has no common sense. It's like all these TikToker, tick famous TikTok people have like no, have lost all their brain cells. Like they traded it to Satan. Uh, and she was like, they were like, hey, uh, hey, kid, uh, if you give me all your brain cells, I'll make you, I'll make you famous on TikTok. And he was like, and they are like, oh, 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 what did he do? Yeah, I'll take that idea. Ooh, that was that was a bad Nicki Minaj impression. Well, let's ignore that. But like, really though, <laughs> no idea, no no duh, it wasn't it was a bad idea. Who thinks who thinks that's a good idea? Like you must have thought it was a good idea at the time because you did it. And yeah. Choice, and I realized that when it was happening, and we talked about it. We talked about it to each other. Sorry, I'm like really stressed out and I can't really get my words out straight but I do realize that I upset a lot of you and hurt a lot of you and no matter what I say about this situation people are still going to make up their own opinions and people are well people are still going to have their own opinions and people for talk like photo people and like they're not and they're not going to pretend like uh they're going to pretend like uh I don't know what I'm even saying anymore but I just know for a fact that that you are a pedo but let's talk about my guy, Carter, or whatever his name is. He kind of got the bag, though. Hey, you know what? I'm big up to my man, Carter, or whatever this dude's name is. Because, you know, he low-key bagged a 20-year-old, and I don't know how he did it. But, hey, bro, congrats. You know what? <laughs> I'll give you, that's all you get, because, yeah, good job, uh, Carter, for bagging a 20-year-old. And she's famous, so if you just didn't, if, no, if, if guys think of those, for those pesky, for those pesky, uh, paparazzi for uh for saying because she was famous too and you could probably gonna made the bag but by the way that's a joke well some of some not some of it's a joke but some it's not a joke but you know you know what i mean some of it's a joke some of it's not a joke all right I'll take that as you will people are gonna keep saying things and that's okay like you do you but i just wanted to make it clear that it's not as bad as everybody's making it out to be yes it is bad what happened the situation that happened is bad yes but People are making it out to be something bigger than it is, and it's not something that Connor and I wanted to be on social media. We don't know how it got out there. We don't know who did it. We just wanted it to stay between us. So pretty much what you're saying is that you had intentions to date the dude, even at, even even that when he knew he was 13, and you and you only stopped dating him because people found out. <sighs> Uh, I think I think we might have to send her to the streets to be honest because that's what you call grade A idiot behavior like who does that who says who who's like oh yeah me and him we're gonna yeah we didn't want anybody to find out we didn't want social media to find out and then says like she's gonna say I don't know if I'm gonna 
keep it up, but uh, keep on saying, keep on watching this until she says it. She says it's not grooming. So let's pretend like you had the intention to say damn until you turned 18. That's that's the, literally the definition of grooming. Bro, these TikTok people, I, I, they're just idiots. Like, who who says, oh, who says, oh, we didn't, we, we weren't, we weren't gonna, we don't know, it was gonna be a thing between me and, uh, be between me and you. And we didn't want social media to find out. And then say, and then say, uh, yeah, it wasn't bad. And she said, she basically said people were boosting the situation, which we, yeah, people were boosting the situation. Like, you got caught being a pedo and kissing a 13 year old child. Yeah, people are gonna boost it. Like, I'm boosting it right now. Honestly, I think that people should be still be talking about it because this is not a thing that we should die out. Like, what happened to Zero? People just stopped talking about Zero. He was a pedo. Uh, uh, Nairo, uh, he he came out with claims, but we need to talk about top stop talking. That's a whole different topic for another day. So yeah, uh, pretty much what I'm saying right now is Zoe Vern, uh, if you're watching this, uh, you're a pedo, and let's continue with the video. And whoever did like the videos, really shitty, but. A pedo for being a pedo, and now she's trying to say, "Oh, it's all, oh, if if you did that, you're actually bad." Like, <laughs> nah, bro, you're a whole pedo, as my as my idol, obviously, Future would say. Quote: She belongs to the streets. Yes, from the gospel of Future, she belongs to the streets because she does belong to the streets. Because you know, oh, uh, whoever leaked the video, uh, whoever leaked the photos, uh, you're a bad person. Not like you're exposing me, uh, grooming a child or dating a child. Yeah, bro, she should be up there with EDP and Mini Lad right now. You know, it's kind of like a, we have, it's kind of like, you know, you know how we have like the, uh, the three musketeers. We have the three, we have the three horsemen of, uh, of pedos. All right, we have Zoe Laverne. We have EDP. Oh, we have Mini Lad boys. We found them. We got, we got the. Whoever was looking for it, because I wasn't, whoever was looking for the three horsemen of pedos, we got them, boys. We found them. We did it. All right? Yeah, so next part, next clip. Next here, Connor. Yeah, if you're watching this, Connor, uh, my bad, bro. Uh, I still applaud you for bagging Zoe Laverne. Good job. And they're probably still dating a secret, to be honest. I don't know. And bye.